What is up guys? Welcome back to Mr. 90th Minute, aka Mr. Fortnite, aka getting dubs on the regular. Uh, and uh, this is a throwback game clip to my first ever Fortnite game. It's like two weeks after the game came out. I started playing it and I'm going to review to my gameplay. And looking back at the gameplay, looking back at the game, looking at how it has evolved throughout. I think it's been out for like almost a year on console. It came out first on, on PC, I believe, and it's meant to be a PC game. But it's um, it, uh, it also works well on console. So right here, I'm playing with my boys. It was it, we played squads, but we dropped in at different locations because we were noobs at the game. The game had just came out. Not a lot of people play the game, and I'm here like looking at the mechanics. Like, it was weird to me. And I was like. You could break walls, you could build stairs and things like that. So it was like something new, it was something I never experienced before in a game. So it was interesting at first, and it still is. It's fun. It's very, it's very addictive game. And uh, I remember in when the game first came out, the circle used to take like ages to to close. So we stayed towards the edge because we were whack and we didn't know how to how to maneuver throughout the game and how to play it. I think right now we're out by the by Wailing Woods right here. We're by Wailing Woods. We're just at the edge of the circle. The circle just closed. I see a gun right here. I didn't understand the colors back then. I see a blue Takashi right there and uh, I picked it up and I traded it in for a pistol and I, I could see looking at my loadout I see that I have uh, two Takashis, a pump, bandages and a assault rifle, a three burst assault rifle and my loadout is not fixed at all it's all over the place usually I like to have my rifle first and a two shotguns either a, a pump and a tank or a pump and a Takashi by Takashi I mean SMG gun and if you know the meme then you know the meme <laughs> but um yeah so we were just here chilling you know hiding out most of the game most of the game we we're just hiding out trying to survive as you can see I have zero kills and I think my partner had like one kill or two I think he had one because he killed somebody in um, retail road and then we moved and um, it's weird like it would change from nighttime to daytime throughout the game and as from the previous clip it was during nighttime and now it was during daytime and while we were up there hiding we heard the supply drop the kit the supply drop drop and it was somewhere up north and but we're just looking around not trying to get caught from the back and uh, my friend went to get the other care package. I got this one. And uh, it came out a rocket launcher and a trap. It was like a zapper, I believe. I forgot the name of it, but it's no longer in the game. They took it out. Traps like used to be insanely hard to set up before. Like You had to be Einstein in order to set them up. It was just too complicated, so nobody used to use traps before. Right now, it's like super easy, and I'm looking at things. I'm surprised. I didn't get sniped, heard a sniper shot, they didn't get sniped, hear people fighting, I haven't taken the shield, so just looking back at my gameplay, I, like, I can see how I evolved, and there's another supply drop all the way up there, and I'm just looking around, looking around, not shielding, sh not shielding up, and I guess I'm a shield up standing up, that is like such a new move, but that's how it was before and I don't think yeah it's a wall dynamo so the wall dynamo was basically like a zapper like a an electrical thing that that zaps you when you walk around it like I don't know it's weird it was like an electrical thing I don't think I had gameplay of it because I never I never knew how to set them up so we're up here in the mountain peak just chilling by the trailer just looking around trying to see where the other people are there's eight people alive ten in total with us and uh, my friend went to get the, the med, he, he needed a med up, but he also saw people down there. And the game was glitchy because it had just came out, so it had a lot of bugs. When you throw grenades, and you could hear only one exploded. I threw three, three in total and only one exploded, which uh, it used to be annoying when that used to happen. And that was, it was a glitch that lasted for a while until they finally were able to fix it. But it was annoying, you used to throw grenades and they would not explode. It, it was it so then we move up to the team on the right we're gonna move towards the right side because we know there's people in front of us and we don't want to engage 
and the circle is closing so it's pushing us in <laughs> my friend is already pushing at the other side and looking at that you, looking at the walls they look freshly built so you could tell there's people there but without the knowledge of playing it I didn't know so I didn't make that call out but now if looking back I would have made that call out so there's people right next to us but we don't know and there's people fighting down there so we know where two teams are there people fighting down there and we don't know there's people on the right side but my friend spots them so he starts shooting his grenade and I take out my launcher and just start spamming them with them just spam and uh playing the game I feel like the grenade launcher is the best is better than the rocket launcher so if he drops one of them he is losing I try to break the wall and then he goes at the opposite side we see them he goes on that side I go through the other side so either way the video is like He's gonna get murked. So now there's three people alive, so that means it's a 2v1 situation. And I remember them telling me to take the scar. We were talking to well, Mike's talking to each other, and he was like, take the scar, take the scar. And uh, I took it, but I don't know what I was doing reloading guns there. <clears throat> so right now we know the guys in front of us and the circle's like in the middle, so we're not gonna try and push. We're gonna wait till the circle starts pushing him and us together. Because if we rush, we probably, if he was good, he probably would have killed us instantly. So we're on, we have the high ground. Like, when you're on the high ground, always keep the high ground. And we're just there waiting for the circle to push. There's like 10 seconds on the clock. We're looking around, looking around. We're like slowly creeping up. And I think I saw him there. I didn't see him the first time. I saw him the second time. And then I just shot him as soon as I could. And two shots with a legendary scar dropped him. And that is the first ever Fortnite game that I won. And it was my first match playing it, so it was pretty exciting. We played later on. We kept on playing for like two or three hours, and we never won anything. But yeah, it's Fortnite, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. Peace.